Well guys, Joe Biden flipped again, this time on PPP loans. Let's see what are the details and what you should know about this. Well guys, uh, what is it? One month after Joe Biden stepped in as a new president, we already saw a couple of uh, new things changed. We saw that uh, the student loans won't be uh, cancelled up to $50,000 as we saw as a promise earlier. Uh, $15 minimum wage, it's kind of a 50-50. We saw changes of the unemployment uh, benefits extensions. The first uh, idea was to be up to September because the budget expires in September. But as we saw, the latest written down bills was until August. And now we're seeing that Joe Biden is focusing on the payment protection program rules. Basically, uh, for two weeks only, businesses with fewer than 20 employees can claim for these relief loans. So, if you have a business that normally employs more than 20 people, you won't be qualified to get these relief loans. Well, my biggest concern now is that people who have a little bit over 20 people, probably they will lay off these people, they will apply for these loans, uh, they will qualify for these loans, and I hope after they get the loan, they will rehire the people that they lay off. But anyway guys, let's go over the details and let's see what we should be aware of. Okay, the restrictions will last for two weeks since Wednesday, okay? The president is expected to formally announce the changes today. Well, there should be a reason for Biden doing this, right? Uh, the goal of Joe Biden and his team is to reach smaller, minority-owned businesses and so proprietaries left behind in the previous round of aid. Uh, we all know, in the first round of PPP loans during the uh, President Donald Trump, a lot of people uh, take advantage, uh, there have been a lot of fraud uh, fines. So, in this way, uh, Joe Biden is trying to target the exact people that he thinks they will need this support. I think this is kind aligns of with the strategy for the third round of stimulus checks in which Joe Biden again wants to target a specific group of people. He doesn't want to give checks to people who are wealthy, who earn a lot of money. Uh, so anyone who is earning above $75,000 as an individual uh, won't be qualified. On the other side, I don't know which experts, but uh, experts said that the demand for these loans actually is slowing down simply because more and more businesses are reopening around the states. So uh, the expectations are that less and less companies will apply. But uh, we all know, this basically means free money. Uh, PPP loans are basically free money. And this is something that a lot of people would definitely take advantage of. Especially when you go and see all of these small restaurants or fast food places uh, that were restricted to have indoor dining, they build these uh, small uh, outdoor areas, you know, they, they rebuild it from nothing. They ordered ACs, uh, tables, they just built like a small houses outside on the street. Most of these people are funded these projects, these extensions, these outdoor areas from these PPP loans. So uh, let's see. How many people will actually be able to take advantage of this new round of PPP loans? Also, from Joe Biden team uh, announced that they actually are looking forward to help people without any employees. People that are running businesses by themselves, uh, people who are independent contractors, uh, self-employed people. And in this way, he definitely want to target uh, people that have uh, little or no money to uh, reopen their business, right? What will be this budget? According to the officials, the program will set aside $1 billion for businesses without employees in low and moderate income areas. So uh, we're expecting announcement, official announcement uh, by noon from Joe Biden and his team for more details because we definitely want to see uh, how these rules will imply who will actually be able to apply because there are always some uh, small uh, details people who are being left in and out from this uh, eligibility criteria. So let's follow up with a later video to see the exact details. But so far we know what is the idea of Joe Biden and his team. He wants to target uh, small companies with less than 20 employees or uh, business owners who are running their business by themselves who doesn't have any employees.